Hey folks, I'm dispersed camped at Craggy Wash near Lake Havasu City. Thanks for watching. Hey folks, it's Mark Dispersed Camping Man and I am currently dispersed camped at Craggy Wash which is uh, near Lake Havasu City. Off of, in order to get here off of uh, Interstate 40, you'll be turning on Highway 95 and then turning on to uh, Craggy Wash which is part of the uh, Bureau of Land Management Public Lands. And you're allowed to camp here for up to 14 days and what's really cool about this spot is it's really close to uh, Lake Havasu City. Let's have a look around. And this is the spot I chose to disperse camp at. I really like this spot. Even though you can tell it's real close to the road there. I mean, I've only had like one or two vehicles go by a day, if that. And my closest neighbor is probably right over there. But you can't see him from here. You might be able to see my next, next neighbor's way over there. So plenty of room out here, even though I did camp probably about two and a half miles in on this road. And when you uh, come in here, the first couple of, uh, about the first mile and a half, it's pretty crowded, a lot of people up through there. But the further you go back, the less crowded it is. So like I said, I'm about two and a half miles in. It's actually been pretty quiet here. I really enjoyed my stay here. I've been here about five days. It's pretty quiet and peaceful around here. And I know one thing, that wind has been non-stop constantly. The last several days, I'm up here on this hill right here. Right there is my closest neighbor right there, pretty far away. The next ones are way over there. Guys, interested in coming here? Just keep going towards the back. A lot more room. But I've been up on that mountain camping or uh, hiking, and I'm camped right on the wash. So I've been hiking out through here. And over there is uh, Lake Havasu City and Lake Havasu. You can almost see it right there. I've been jumping up on these mountains, checking out everything. A lot of camping and a lot of uh, hiking to do down through here. Been real nice here like i've said earlier uh, about two miles down the road is uh, lake havasu city the lake and the actual city uh, lake havasu city has got pretty much a little bit of everything in there you got the uh, home depot uh, walmart lowe's a lot of eating establishments that you want to go to and also uh, when i went uh, doing my tourist thing down there i uh, no, read something about the london bridge over there so I jumped on my motorcycle and uh, drove up to the London Bridge, which is a pretty cool little bridge right there. I guess it's uh, mainly for tourists or whatever. And I think they imported that bridge from uh, London, from what I'm understanding, which is a pretty cool bridge. Uh, took some pictures and video and walked across the bridge. And right after you get across the bridge, there's like this uh, railing there. People have been locking locks on. I guess it's uh, to keep you uh, married or boyfriend or girlfriend or whatever. I thought that was pretty cool, and that was a lot of locks right there. 
Then uh, you can go down uh, the steps, down to the actual Lake uh, Havasu, uh, underneath the uh, London Bridge. They got a lot of uh, tourist markets there, I guess what you could say. Uh, a lot of eating established down through there. Uh, the only place I did eat was probably at Jimmy John's. Believe it or not, <clears throat> I never ate at Jimmy John's before. So I thought I'd try that out, which is uh, pretty good if you ever ate there. Do try it. Real nice uh, sub sandwiches right there. And if you're interested in coming here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to jump on my motorcycle and I'm going to go uh, out to Interstate 95 and then ride my motorcycle in and show you around this area right here. Hey folks, I am at the uh, beginning of the dirt road here into a craggy wash. And right there, Lake uh, Havasu City right there. You can see the Lake Havasu right there. And you're turning right out for the airport right here. It's a privately owned airport. <clears throat> and once you turn off the uh, main highway right there, you come across the uh, cow guard right there. And then <clears throat> you can't camp in the first mile on this road because uh, it's a private property, I guess. And as soon as a craggy wash camping, one mile ahead is where you can start at. And this is uh, so here's part of the airport <coughs> airfield, and uh, after the one mile mark, that's when it turns into uh, BLM land, public land, right up here. And this is road 4429. There's a craggy wash, no camping for one mile. You must not leave personal property unattended for more than 24 hours. So here's a uh, pretty big spot you can uh, disperse camp on if you want. definitely good looking property out down through here <clears throat> I'm happy to say a lot of people also uh, police up after themselves pick up the trash I don't see hardly any trash down through here which is a good thing through here. This wash goes a ways back several miles. motorhome class C looks like those folks above in front of me is just now pulling in <clears throat> a lot of space right here to my left and there's a lot more place you can camp right down through there. It's got this huge fix wheel right here. Another truck camper. <clears throat> He's also got a Honda CRF in front of his bumper. Guys from Florida. Tent campers. Got his own perch right up there in that class B right there. He's up there looking down on this peasants. <clears throat> They're outside. 
start playing cards. I might say it, it look, <coughs> this place does look a little busy, but there's a lot of room here. You can f definitely find a spot out here if you want to. <coughs> Most of you guys know I like uh, being off to myself, you know. I don't want to be around nobody. No way I can just do my thing. <coughs> I went way back in the wash. I found a perfect little spot back here. Do you some tent color captain? <coughs> Bluebird bus back here. <coughs> There's a bus over there, two of them. Bus over there. Oh, there's three buses out there. Home sweet home right there, folks. <clears throat> yeah, folks, uh, Craggy Wash, uh, about two miles uh, from uh, Lake Havasu City. Pretty cool little camping spot. I've uh, been here probably about five days, and I'm headed out now. Hey, guys, appreciate you guys for watching. <laughs>